Hello and welcome everybody. So today we'll talk about some of the new features and add-on in Houdini 19.5. We'll start with the flip new features. So let's start by exploring the flip tab as you can see here. So let's create something quick from the configure uh, ocean layer. So flip configure ocean layer. So here it is. Give it a minute to load. And immediately we can see it in the sub level. So first thing first, visualization point as a sphere will make it point not as a sphere. So let's make it as a default. So save permanently default. So it always will be like this. So here they started with a tube they made it a VDB so we have a surface then they are applying a mask around it let's go inside this is the mask volume wrangle already set up fluid volume SDF and here we have it as a mask that's output of this uh, subnet here they adjust the domain by this volume wrangle according to the depth and the mask and here we have the setting for the flip tank very back, compact so particle separation let's make it 3 just for us to see the grid scale the bounding the density still 1000 and we have the gravity going down surface tension viscosity and the attributes down below we have the flip solver so let's run it and it's uh, it is moving according to the spectrum here so in the flip solver we have where to start the frame and to reset the simulation so this is the setup particle separation we can change it simulation steps the water line and off and the boundary velocity driven or pressure driven and here we have the type of collision particle or move outside collision ground if you need one and the flip behavior splashy or swirl let's make it splashy air incompressibility and enforced particle separation and this is the visualization and this is the advance so you can uh, save a checkpoint when you sim on the other hand this is the ocean spectrum approximately the same setting in here where we can save it visualization spectrum and this is the wave instance and the mask And in the evaluate, see we have down sampling, fall off, maximum depth. You can play with this parameter. And this is the volume with the SDF points and export the texture in case you want to render in Redshift or R node. Let's add grid. Take this aside point the grid or review grid you can do this one also so this is my wave and this is my flip solver as we sim it now I, I want to make it collide with a, let's say a sphere okay so let's have it here let's add a sphere the sphere and make it a little bit bigger wider and uh, let's make it fall down or be dissolver and move it a little bit up let's just have this one okay I'll move it a little bit up so it will fall down so here 
I will remove the ground so the RPD soil bar they rearrange the tabs see the pieces leaving the collision animated deforming this is the collision geometry forces if we have constraint see they change the constraint now do we have so soft and hard I want the advanced constraint see it's collapsible now export broken constraint this is new also Vix snippet we have it here the guide also visualization advanced constraint glue soft hard contwist slider and we have now output good so we have it like this falling ah, I want to remove the ground where is the ground ground plane none so there is no interaction to make an interaction right click we go to flip and we have here a flip where is it 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 we call it the uh, flip collide flip collide ah flip collide see as uh, in vellum as you can see here in the middle one the container is in blue here we have it in blue we'll put it in the middle so this is the collider node and this is for the colliding object so let's view it now let me pause till it's finished so here it is colliding with a flip and soap level again very cool so in a nutshell there is still plenty of points and nodes to tackle so let's see the flip configure of uh, the rubber toy let's go to the solver and see what it do but I will decrease the vertical separation to 3 yeah, 3 is too low make it to And this is a demonstration of the viscosity. So we have the test geometry subdivided a color here viscosity attribute. So we have viscosity. This is the flip tag. And the boundary so we need flip tank we need flip boundary and the flip solver and here we go more videos will be updated with the new features thank you for watching